everybody, Darren Slaughter here with a quick tip that I think could help you get a little business. It's a little sneaky, a little, um, you know, gray area, but it's a great opportunity to try and grab some business from your former competition. Um, we all know that the last couple of years, the economy has taken its toll across every industry and every vertical. But I expect or I suspect that the home services category really got clobbered um, and a lot of small time operators or a lot of companies that really probably shouldn't have been in, in the space got washed out. Now, you may have had three or four or five or ten guys or companies that you competed with in your, in your area that have gone out of business. And here's a slick way to try and capitalize on some of their former advertiser or their, their former clients or customers, maybe some of their old advertising. Um, if they had websites that they let expire, you could go and register those domain names. And if somebody comes across their old advertising or if they have it, or if they're an old customer or a client and they want them to do some additional work, um, what you could do is you could register their domain name get it set up so that it forwards any searches or click-throughs directly to another website, your website. So let's say ABC Construction Company went out of business and they had ABC Construction as their URL or their, their website. You could register abcconstruction.com and then just set it so that it forwards directly to you. So if somebody does a search, they'll see ABC Construction and when they click on it, they'll wind up on your website. Now, again, that technique isn't for everybody, but if you're scrambling, you're trying to get some work, you're trying to establish yourself, and you want to get you want to get kind of a, a slick move that maybe some of your competitors won't do or don't know, that's a great way to try and capitalize on some old uh, business. So think of it for what it's worth, but um, it works, and it's just up to you as to whether or not you want to put something like that into place. Have a good day.